In my last video about SSH keys, I showed you how to create a pair of SSH keys and then what to do with the public key. Now here, what we're going to do is we're going to use our private SSH key to log in to another computer. So the first thing we have to do is we have to have our computer. So let's say we have a computer with user at, um, what is it called this? Crypto, crypto, dot test.com now if you just try and and click open it'll open this one time and it's not going to save it what we want to do is save it so let's go ahead and give it a name and we'll just call it crypto one and then click save now if we do this, it's going to ask us for a password. So we don't want to use our password, we want to use the SSH key. So what we have to do is click on the little plus sign for SSH and then click on off, not the plus sign next to it, but off itself. Click browse and now you're going to find your SSH key. So in this case, um, documents, keys, and here is the private key. So we'll click open. And then if you hit open immediately, it'll open using this SSH key. But the next time you go to open it, you'll need to enter that again. So don't click open. Instead, scroll back up to the top, click session. Now you're back here, click save again. And then that way, when you open it the next time, your off key will still be there. All right, so there's our off key. So we're going to close out of it and come back into it. We're going to load crypto and you're using your auth key again. So now when you click open this time, you're going to see that it's going to open using your SSH key. And in case you're wondering why you'd want to use an SSH key instead of just a password, when you use SSH keys, it allows you to disable password logins, which means that it's impossible for someone to hack into your um, your virtual private server by using a password or stealing the password. They would have to have your private key. So it also eliminates brute force attacks. So really, really helpful um, in its best security practice to disable uh, password logins altogether and only use your SSH keys. This is Pat Heyman with Masternode Setup Service. If you're interested in having me set up or host your Masternode or Zencash Secure Node, fill out the form below the video description.